Number two, okay, want to recharge chiropractic passion? Throw out the old stuff. Number two is throw out the old stuff. Now here's what you want to do. Start with the physical stuff. Go to your closet at home. Take out your old clothes. Throw it out. Oh, I may lose weight and get back into this. Get rid of it. You'll buy new stuff. Okay? Old stuff in the garage. Throw it out. I had a bocce set. You know when was the last time I played bocce, for God's sakes? Okay, it must have been 25 years ago. Throw it out. Okay? Start to physically get rid of old stuff. Okay, and then you take it from the physical to the mental. Right? What does that mean? Old concepts. Old thought patterns. Things you do like that. You, you automatically say it. You automatically think of things in a certain way. Get rid of that. Start looking at the negative thoughts that hit you have creeping in there. But what do you do about the negative thoughts? You know, I asked Dr. Sid about that one time, years and years ago. And he said, you ever, have you ever watched him, especially in his earlier years, when uh, some of us older people watch Dr. Sid walk around, and he'll, he'll talk, and he'll, you know, so he'll do this, a little shift in his shoulder. He told me, he said, that was, he would do that deliberately when he had a negative thought. That was his way of eliminating the negative thought. Okay? What do you do when you have a negative thought? Do you let it fester? Do you analyze it? Or do you learn to let it go? That's a negative one. Out. That's it. Okay, so that's throwing out the old stuff and the old concepts, mentally. And spiritually, you want to do the same thing. Throw out the old stuff. Throw out the old stuff. I found, for me, that spiritually I would judge people. Not mentally, but spiritually. I would judge them, right? And I realized that in judging people, I was not standing in their shoes. And I didn't know whatever was going on spiritually, how it was serving them. Because it was serving them in a way maybe that I wouldn't want to be served, but it was serving them in some way. Throw it out. Get rid of the judgment. Throw out the old stuff. Because God can only give you good new stuff if you make room for it. Okay? I went to one practice one time. This practice was seeing about uh, 180 patients a week. And they asked me, what can we do? We're trying to get over 200, but we can't seem to get over 200. Right? We just can't seem to get over 200. Right? So I looked in the office, and the first thing I saw, I said, Bigger garbage cans. What? I said you need bigger garbage cans. Why? Because your garbage cans are this little. How is God going to give you more people if you're not prepared to handle them? So the next week, this person went out and bought these huge garbage cans. They put the thing. That week they, they saw 250. Not just 200, but 250 that week. Okay? Throw out the old stuff. Make room for the new. Make room for what God can send you. It's hard. It's hard for God to put a hundred dollar bill in your pocket if you're standing there with your hands in your pockets guarding. You follow what I'm saying? You're gonna have to release something. There. Open up. Let it come in. Okay. So get rid of the old stuff now.